<laughs> What's up, everyone? It's, it's Kevin and Ray from no. X Ray and Vav. X Ray. From AchievementHunter.com, and this is Hitman Absolution. And I've got to tell you, Ray, I'm absolutely excited I'm about this. I'm very excited for this game. Because of the title. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Played Hitman before? Yeah, Hitman Blood Money and 1 and... Th oh, excuse me, 2 and 3. I did not play the Blood first one. Blood Money is 6 years old. Can you believe that? That is it's like actually a like decade. This is the fifth Hitman game, and they made the first four in six years. And it's then crazy to think that another six years to make the six next years one. ago, Hitman came out, and that was on the 360. This one's also on the 360. Yeah, but the, it's like one of those really early 360 games. Yeah, it was almost like a launch when you look at title. It yeah, yeah, it's it's still a lot sweet. of fun if you haven't played it. Pick it up now. So I freaking love this game. The uh, the physics are amazing, mm -hmm. which I'm all about. Hitman, the first Hitman, I was excited to play because it was the first game I ever played with ragdoll physics. Yeah, and and I was ragdoll all about physics it. Just like, are like. Yeah, I mean like, you can't see that in the video, but I, I just had a seizure. <laughs> I had a little seizure. There's also an amazing attention to detail. There's stuff that I wouldn't even think of. Like there was a moment where I was climbing through a vent and I saw a load of fag ends just like push through the. You're looking at me funny. Um, yeah, I'm just I'm listening. Like push through the end. Like, I'll show you. Like, oh, so you got a clip. <laughs> like, see, who would have thought of that? <laughs> to actually like at the end of the vent, put in cigarette butts. That's detail, the attention right? to detail. Attention though. to detail. Squeenix is providing. So here are some achievements. Let's do achievements. First one. The Russian hair. It's spelled hair wrong. Yeah, it's a rabbit, isn't it? Like a rabbit. No, because no, then it would be the Russian rabbit. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> nice one, Ray. Thanks, man. You performed 47 headshots using a sniper rifle for 20 gamer score. There was actually a secret achievement in Blood Money for killing 47 people. Exactly, 47 people. Which I, I got completely by fluke. I did it in that did Mardi Gras really? level. I was like, oh, I must have murdered 47 that's, people. Uh, Sweet that's one. a lot of luck. I saved right before I went to the exit, and I'm like, oh, I got 35. Then I would reload the save, kill 12 people. Oh, that works as well. Yeah. Bloody little jebby, 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 piece. jebby bloody jebby. something. Damage control for 20 game score. You contain the situation gone bad. I did this when I actually threw a gasoline tank into a crowd of people, blew it up, and then hid in the container until everyone forgot <laughs> that something happened. So it's like mass murder, and then it's like, hide. Yeah, this game is good because you can play as a stealthy man, which yeah, I'm all about. I'm a big fan of Splinter Cell. I like that kind of style. Or you can just whip out a shotgun and blast the maid in the face, which yeah, is and what then I'm doing right there in the video. You can beat the level hall ever. Yeah, and choose. it's actually it's one of the, those games where it's fun both ways. Like yeah. some stealth games, it's kind of, you, you're doomed if you actually pull out a gun and start running around. Yeah. This one, you can kick anus. You can pick up machine guns and shotguns. There's a joke about both ways being fun. I just can't think of it right now. <laughs> so I'm just going to Get back right. to me on that yeah, one, right? Yep. <laughs> they use the, the same voice actor as well for the oh, original games. Yeah. At one point, you pull off a uh, wrestler's mask and say, Remember me. I was like, that was badass. <laughs> Did you have that preloaded? Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, next I remember at one point, like, they weren't going to have the voice actor. Yeah, they, they got rid of it. They're like, then... yeah, fuck you. And then the game was about to come out. They're like, uh, okay, yeah, we yeah, need, we need back. the ball guy. They actually modeled the the look of Hitman on that guy as well. Yeah. The guy who voices him is If you see the bold. voice actor, it's like, all right, that's 847 yeah, without the, the barcode. Dude. I think it's called David Bateson. Yeah, we'll call him Age 47. Yeah, Age 47. Rock steady for 20 hey, games scored. You executed turtles. a point shooting with at least three kills. It's That's kind of that uh, Splinter Cell, Splinter Cell kind of thing, yeah. conviction kind of thing where you can tag people uh, depending on how much instinct you have. Oh, okay. It's, it's all kind of like instinct. the bullet time thing, gotcha. but you can't dive around like that. Okay. It's pretty sweet, though. You can shoot explosives as well. So I, I, instead of shooting heads in bullet time, I just pick a load of explosives and then afterwards just watch the room just go like... Did you do that in that level where you massacred everybody? I did. I, I did. tend to do that quite a lot. Next achievement. Next one. Whoops! You made a kill look like an accident. See, the main targets is always somewhere in the level where you can make him look like they were an idiot and like something fell. Yeah, I remember head. in Blood Money you could always like put poison in like a drink. Yeah. Or in like the wedding level you could put poison in the cake and yeah. then the groom would or eat like, it and then it'll be like, Ugh. or like bomb a chandelier to fall down on yeah. someone's face. Do you remember that? I, I and actually, it's like, oh, it's an accident. I mean, there was always a bomb on that chandelier. Just have to go <laughs> off this time. In this one, I electrocuted someone who was pissing on a on a car. I attached some power lines to it and then <laughs> zapped him. That's pretty awesome. And I dropped a disco ball on someone's head. Interestingly, this looks like a scrotum. It does. You can see that in we the uh, tile. We zoomed into the uh, achievement <laughs> tile. It looks like Disco looks like Stu hangables. dancing below a scrotum. Yeah. Next achievement, Silent Assassin, obviously. Uh, every single level you can get rated based on how you do it. For a Silent Assassin, you need to make it through the level killing only your target without being spotted. Can't, do they do they have to be accidental kills or can you just nope, like you straight can, up kill them? You can just can't. shoot them in the face and hide them in a bucket or what well, a bucket how probably would you a hide? box. <laughs> just like man, I just killed this guy. Him. He's seven foot five. Oh, I got a bucket. Let me just squeeze him in there. <laughs> can you uh, like I remember Hitman Blood Money? If you do poorly, you have like a notoriety and then you can like pay off some. 
Yeah, there's actually no carryover from level to level oh, in this okay. game. They got rid of that. Gotcha. They also got rid of the fact that you, on, in Blood Money you could kill people and they would actually get body bagged and dragged away. Oh, yeah. Which I thought was cool. They took that out as well, which is an interesting decision. This game actually also takes place in one big streak. Like, in previous games you just do missions like all around the world. Like, yeah. you'd be in China and then you'd be in, like, South Africa Well, this one, it's like... This you, one's just, like, you're beginning working for your to agency end. and then you, like, don't kill somebody and they're like, oh, we're mad at you. Yeah. And then they go after it's basically you. just, like, a beginning to end story of you effing people up. Awesome. Massively. Information is power. Collect all the evidence. Would that be the collectibles of this game? That would be. There's actually each level is broken down into probably between like two and five segments that you okay. can try, and each one has an evidence. Usually there's a, like, there's like twenty missions in this game, right, or something ridiculous. Dude, like there's that. twenty. Yeah, there's twenty levels, including the. It's a lot of game. Block. And there's a lot, a lot of game, of, Gavin. A lot of sections. So many fun levels. Next one. It's all in the wrist. It's all Not in the wrist. about masturbation, right? It's I'm actually about throwing. Anyway. Okay. <laughs> Pretty much any object you find in the world, you can throw, mm -hmm. and some of them can be used as weapons, like I'm a screwdriver like or a, or a like knife that. or a fire axe or a tomahawk. Gotcha. And uh, you can lob those, and they actually stay in the people in the players' heads. <laughs> so you're like dragging around a dude with a fire axe That's sticking out of his cranium. Fucking amazing. It's pretty amazing. Next one, Grandmaster, for 150 gamer score. That's hefty. Yeah, it's pretty hefty. And I haven't got that one yet. But you, yeah, each level you do, you have different challenges. You can do like take all the outfits in this level, or kill this guy in a certain way and the, that stacks up over time i got you are there like a bunch per uh, per level yeah there's, there's, there's tons there's tons i haven't i think i've got like 50 unlocked so far i want to show you this this okay. is when i uh oh, i gonna... threw a remote mine on the reception desk <laughs> of a nice apartment let's, building. Uh, let's check it out this is an example of all right i'm guessing you're in instinct mode oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh gavin that is a suspicious act <laughs> That's an example of uh, maybe not the stealthiest of methods to go through that. But a fun method. Yeah. And a so method nonetheless. What do you know about contracts mode, Ray? I don't know anything about contracts so it's like mode. I know second... Hitman 3 was called Hitman contracts. Yeah, it's confusing because there's Absolution, which is the main story. And then there's contracts. And when you press it, it actually says Hitman contracts. And I was like, am I playing Hitman 3 again or what? But it's just a, basically a variation of all the missions. And you can set contracts yourself. So say It's like the game's multiplayer mode, right? Yeah, you like Kinda. challenge your friends. So say I walk into a level and I change into like a chicken costume and then I snipe like a policeman in the head. You can yeah. mark anyone of importance in the game as a target. Oh, any like and then you kill or NPC or something. And then like yeah, and then you pick an exit point and leave. So you're yeah. basically saying, right, you have to kill this guy, but if you do it the exact way I did it, you, you get, get you get bonus points like okay. don't get spotted. Make sure you're wearing the chicken suit and make sure you use the sniper. And you use the experience to get like yeah, more you get and money stuff. and then you can build up. You can buy the guns and shit as well. That's awesome. It's like kill Steve while yeah. wearing a chicken suit. Kill with this a guy. Big black dildo. I'm not sure what people are gonna think of this game. I'm a massive Hitman fan anyway, so I obviously love it. It's probably one of my favorite games that came out this year. Probably one of my most anticipated titles yeah. this year. So uh, well, yeah, that's, that's Hitman. Can't wait it. to play it. That's Hitman Absolution. Here you go, Ray. Oh, hey, you, all right, it's on the floor Missed now. It, he dropped it. I did Missed drop it. it. Hey, hey, remember that thing about the both ways? Yeah. Sex with dudes and chicks. Ah. Both fun. Both fun. X-Ray and Vav, out. Hey, dickhead, you know you can't be in here.